Well, the Durham County Sheriff's Office is requesting more help from officials as violent crime continues to rise. Yeah, the county is responding by allocating uh, more than $47 million to help keep deputies safe in the current proposed budget. CBS 17's Ben Boken has that story. In a recent spree of shootings across Durham, suspects using higher caliber weapons creating a greater risk for deputies. Sheriff Clarence Burkhead saying the upcoming county budget plays a part in protecting his team and the community. Right now, we are on pace to surpass last year's record-setting number of shootings in Durham City, Durham County. On Thursday, the Durham County Sheriff's Office presented its latest budget priorities, including the need for new guns, protective vests, and vehicle replacements. One of the goals is to provide deputies with vests that offer a higher level of protection as the sheriff says they're currently outgunned on the streets. I think you're well aware that we are unfortunately have tremendous budget challenges this year. Right now the jail dealing with 83 vacancies out of 222 authorized positions. The sheriff's office asking for money to give detention officers protective vests for the first time ever, providing more security as inmates pose a greater threat with homemade weapons. Some might ask, why have you never had this? Well, we've never seen the type of incidents that we're seeing in our facility now. The sheriff saying the budget requests are a need to continue service. You have deputies that are safe, community is safe, and we can go into these situations with a level of confidence that we may not have right now because of some of the things that we're seeing in Durham. A pair of budget work sessions are set to take place next week. In Durham, Ben Boken, CBS 17 News.